So what is a checksum? Well, it is used to check the sum or amount of data to ensure the data integrity of a file. So if data is downloaded and if in transit data is lost or mangled, the checksum will determine if there is something wrong with the file. Uh, this sounds very similar to e-tags, which we just covered. Um, the difference is that e-tags is for checking if the contents has changed, where checksum is to ensure the data integrity if something is uh, wrong with the file. So uh, seems very similar, but they do different things. Amazon S3 uses checksums to verify data integrity of files on the upload or download, and AWS allows you to uh, change the checksum algorithm because you can use different algorithms depending on what your use case is. And the ones that we have available to us is CRC32, CRC32C, SHA-1, and SHA-256. So hopefully that is clear that checksums is for data integrity. E-tags is to see if the contents of a file has changed. Um, but there you go.